All right, so uh, super hot lately. Um, it's ridiculously hot, super sunny, so I don't want to go and be standing out in the sun all day. So I was trying to think of somewhere to go that was nice and had plenty of shade and stuff like that. Well, I've been doing a lot of certain creeks and stuff around here that are nice and shady, but I don't want to keep going to the same places over and over. So I'm coming down here surrounded by construction workers coming down here to the river walk figured I'd hang out under a couple of bridges for a while see if I can pick up any fish so let's get to it bait I'm using is a skinny Senko Texas rig got a real light weight up on the front lead weight and I see somewhere I need to cast it's a nice tree right here creating some shade and there's a tunnel across the way there so this is this is a nice low platform close to the water it's a good spot hey what's up man <laughs> yeah, I just got here. Found a nice area. There's a couple of free parking spots too. Alright, the water's not very clear, but it is it's clear enough to catch something. There's I can see vegetation out there. So Oh come on, there's a bite right there. Okay. I'm throwing it into that corner and working it across done it twice already and both times I had a bite so there's something hanging out right in the middle here I just lost one right now oh, no. yeah <laughs> all right well the boat just came through here kind of stirred it up a little bit so I'm gonna let it settle for a while and uh, Greg also just called me said he's on his way so I'm gonna head back up this way towards where we parked or where I parked and I'll uh, just fish that area until he gets here, then we'll head down. There's actually that blue ball floating down there. There's actually a school of big tilapia hanging out all around it. Every time I try to turn the camera on to record the fish, they disappear. But they're around here, so... Cool little bass following it. Bunch of little ones. Okay, there's a ton of, they're all little bass. There's probably like 10 of them right there. Where's your mommy? I lost two right here earlier. Haven't landed anything, but I've been getting plenty of bites. Oh, look, I got one. Ah. Oh. I was like, I kept feeling taps, and I bring it up, and it's like, oh look, I got one, but he's just holding the tail. <laughs> no, it was a bass. Huh? Yeah, they're doing sunfish things down here. It's a bunch of big tilapia around too. There we go. Ah, that was a nice one too. Felt like it was at least a two pounder. Oh, the bat bridge? Nah, I didn't go that far. I just went to the next street up and was fishing under that bridge. And I think I might have one actually. Yeah. Somehow he's hooked on the outside of his mouth. Uh, it might belong. Huh? Swiped at it. No, I legitimately caught it. Uh, no, it might <laughs> there we go. Ah, oh, he spit it. <sighs> yep. 
that one felt bigger than the last one. Not too big though. You know, I wonder if the uh, the riverboat cruises and stuff, if they ever like auction off their old boats that they don't use anymore. Imagine getting one of those. It's like a pontoon boat. Take that out to the lake or something. Yeah. Got one? Big sunfish? Long ear. On the jerk bait, I figured that would bring in better quality quantities. But wow, that thing's huge. It's it. I took a <laughs> picture of it. Good. <laughs> it. Uh, nope. Oh uh, yeah, maybe about four feet. It's up to my first eyelid here. Four and a half. How do you cross over me like that? Like, yeah, but you're hanging on something. You're not even, you're wrapped around a tree branch over here. You are. I just missed one. I just missed one. Because that lady said something to me and I turned and the fish grabbed it and I missed. Yeah. They're dragging it across the bottom real slow now. They drain it, it seems like they drain it once a year. But it still has a pretty good population of decent sized fish, so I don't understand that. So they must not be draining it completely or the fish have somewhere they can hide. But since we came all the way this way, I was throwing the Texas rig worm, so I'm gonna switch it up and throw a swim bait on the way back. He's following me, but... There you go. Oh, did he snap? No? Yeah. Okay, because he almost popped me in the face. <laughs> yeah, you know, it gets old after like, you know. What do you catch? Fish? fish? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know. Fish a lot of stuff in here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, pulled a couple scooters out. <laughs> now, it's mostly, uh, we catch bass mostly, but really? there's, there's a mix of a lot of different stuff in here. Bass, catfish, tilapia. So, yeah, I wouldn't eat anything out of this area. No, so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Got one following me, but no, nope, he turned away. The minnows were looking at it. That one. Very nice one. Hey, Greg. Ah, oh, no. Chill. Nice one, but. Got another one. Back to back. Well, I got a sunfish and two bass so far. 
they appear to be hugging the wall on this side because I had back to back right there, back to back casts with fish right along this wall. Oh, Greg's got one. Oh. Yeah? Was it along the wall or on the middle? Yeah. No, there it is over there. See it? Yeah. Oh, he had it. Or he's maybe he's still got it. Yeah, he's got it. I thought he came off, but he was on it the whole time. As soon as it hit the water, he darted towards it. Yeah. There you go. Okay, let me try to shoot an outro again. As soon as I start recording and trying to talk, all these people start running past me. One of them bumped into me and pushed me into the rail and broke my scale. <sighs> so now that I'm up off the river walk, I can talk. Uh, it seems like the bass bite is finally starting to pick up again. Uh, today was the first day in a long time I've caught multiple bass on artificials. The other day I caught some on night crawlers, but that doesn't really count. So it's starting to look good again, especially places where it's real shady like this. And yeah, so I'm supposed to be at dinner right now. Everybody's waiting for me at the restaurant. I'm actually uh, almost half an hour late because I'm still fishing. I was still fishing, but I need to get out of here and go. So thanks for watching. See you next time.